What's up guys, this is me, G Booger Year 2, and welcome back to Pikmin G Deluxe. We are continuing our journey, or our little own meeting today, to read the full on Pikmopedia. And last week we got through the, we just got through like the first two bosses, which I thought took long, but no. It's got a little bit, way more. But like, it just feels gone because we're reading so much. But then I close out of it, and then I see like, I still have way more to go. But maybe these will go a little faster, who knows? Like, who knows how this is gonna go? Because these notes can be very short or very fast. With well, Omar, that's not the case. But let's go ahead and continue on with the Prizoclasmic Slooch. A coating of pure fire? Now that's armor, which it needs, because it's very slow uh, to both move and attack. And even the fire armor does nothing against Red Pikmin. Back to the drawing board. Just a start points for a cloak of pure fire. I could pull up a look like that. I don't like to leave the essence strike when it's coming out. It's tough to be a defense made entirely out of scorching flames. If you don't take it seriously, it will be way too hot to handle. Fortunately, I just hot boiled enough to take it. So I'm only going to just give me that icy stare. Move the corner to the forest. Cook over the charcoal grill until you get rare. Wait. How do you cook it when... I, I, I'm not a scientist, but... Isn't it mostly cooked up? I guess he's talking about the corpse. Alright. Now, we're going gonna, gonna to continue using the same all voice as I did last time. Um, again, make sure to let me know if, like, if I should try to work out my all my voice. Um, if I need to make any try changes of it. But here we go. Price of Cutter Sleech. Salukina so, Volcanus Sleech Family. A species of turtle is no coin and family smokies is still the traditional shell. Cookies still smoke occurs through a closer circulation of me because the forest never reaches skin. Those looking at us with these creatures that are about to get rid of one causing one spread forest by crossing by crossing Russian plants. Interesting. Well, I guess that makes sense. Since when a sluice goes into the water, you can see it still has this, like, orange, like, line texture around it of its, like, you know, slimy parts. But it's still can it's still gonna live without the fire. Okay. Male shear grub. Those jars are stronger than you expect. I haven't seen anything like that can grip like that outside of factory robots. I don't get these creatures. They have a good thing going on the ground when it's dark and quiet. What can this use all day away instead of making trouble for us? That's a good question. These nasties are number one reason why I keep my whistle at handy at all times. You gotta be quick with whistle finger to lend your squat to leave your squat safety when you're full ground and start to rumble underneath your feet. Keep a close eye on any picker when their hands full. These critters like to go after those first. And they're freaking fast at too. Like, I I like, sheer grubs are so fast to eat Pikmin. Well sheer grubs, male sheer grubs and sheer wigs. They're so fast to eat Pikmin. You have to be very quick to save them. Alright, hey Louie. So we says we see both a cross with this and where it's sliced avocado. We go to the meat, the choice and the cheese is less like brown one. Sheer grub male. Hamigia mandibulosa. Mandibular family. This piece is the male sheer grub. Having lost both its wings, but wings and wings. The male burrows into the soil and waits for the much more creatures to pass by. These mandibles can be dangerous and the creatures such typically easy prey. Interesting. No, I'm glad we did the old ones for Pikmin 2, because I definitely have forgot some stuff. I had no idea. Like, I knew they lost their wings. I had no idea that they actually lost their legs, too. Okay. Interesting. Yellow Spectralids. It's only the first exhibit is swift electric flight. If you can catch it when it's stationary, it's easy to take down. But there's no point unless you're desperate for nectar. If the color yellow can fly, it'll be this animal. It's so thin and papery that it's hardly anything apart from color. I I think I like to fly, but maybe not if I had to give up any of my substance. This one's okay. As a wild as the way it goes, it's nice shit to go, but it's not as freaking as a rubber ducky. <laughs> freaking the captain is rubber ducky. That's my favorite like thing out of this whole entire game. Besides really just it's absolutely exploding out out of nowhere. You know what? <laughs> this is another thing! The explosion is not explained. <laughs> I guess so funny. Can I love Louie? Speaking of, for tissue overcharger, don't lose the ball flying. 
can also be used as shoes or skews or suits. One of the first rules of fur and arts. Your structure is for the story. Jano Prit Mattis for the Bi family. This program both for difference from other specialists as the only case is flowing in the wings. When we're across the world with red our offspring has a twenty-four chapter and here these spots of red colored wings. Well this comes a new species. Oh well, guess it does. <laughs> I mean we got our answer right here. Sand Belching Mirror Slug. Ah uh, yes. This boss. His eyes are so ugly. Like, like, look at the, like, I, you can barely see his eyes up here. It's just, the eyes is what makes it worse for me. Like, if it didn't have eyes, then I'll be completely fine with it. It mostly stays below the sand, but such as this is held, the lot of balls of sand I pissed them. If they're hit and stuck in the sand, they don't have any good defense against a digger in the beneath them. It reminds me of a little of going to the beach and how other kids will bury me in the sand. I miss those days, but I gotta focus on saving Coop by now. Well, I mean, as Charlie has suggested, I think you can just make a tropical island on this area, so you can have fun with that. I should get close, and it just hides in this dumb sailing hole. So I move away, and it still has those sand balls. It's also a tossing around. What's the guy against me, huh? Air where we found this creature was practically. Hey, there we go. <laughs> Perfect timing. Paradise. I still have to go back and slip you around with my sand. Same with my rubber ducky. Maybe the crew will let me do it if I call it, if I call it a training exercise. These are cold poisons. So cold enough to remove from many stones. So it's clean me into thick pieces and poison the girl. So I'll pour a dinner cold and barbecue sauce to so the cookies. So I see sticky and crisp. So I'm about your mirror slug. Yes, tropod angrily. Mirror slug family. This giant was for the other part. How do you put this giant was of orifice? It shows a cool shape chart with a shiny wire and works before the hole in it. The main ocean shows a full mouth and an anus. Okay, so we're just allowed to say that now. Great. When the hole's on, the ground is going to do a touch of candle on a cool bit of pores or holes when they're injected. The system is just an odd vibration. The best way to catch it off guard is just our friend and Jen, everybody can start it. Okay, cool. Thanks. Dwarf. Orange bull board. Compared to the red ones, you seem to have a slightly higher vitality. When they swarm, we're trying to stay calm and aim at the weak spot on the backs. It's as sweet as its larger counterpart, so it makes sure to take a toll on the skin. You know what helps with that? A nice juice cleanse. Little but aggressive. It's not half the problem as big as cousins are, but it's much harder to spot. Camouflage or no camouflage, it'll have to get out of pretty eerie in the morning, too. Hey, where did it go? The dark was a bear. This is good as creatures who want to go to the north. Great way of the two times. Dwarf orange bulwarp, Pesaurus, Set Dukili, Orgeneum, Red Buck Family. Just like the dwarf orange bulwarp, next, the three of the normal bulwarps. It was three of the orange bulwarp, maybe from there, and also it's just. You should feel like it has a corner for this theory. Okay, I don't know why I expected something different from that. <laughs> but it's, it's really just the same thing. I don't know why I expected something different. Why the bull? Its eyes have been dis deprecated, so it relies on smell to find prey. And it can swallow it with its huge mouth. It's slow enough to make getting around it for a rear so a simple job. That's where you can tell where its rear is from its front. I love dumplings, but the surface size here is too big even for me. Plus, it's just skin looks tough and rubbery for me to dig into. Pass. The stunt where his water strikes blue into his runner, making it almost invisible, won't work on me. You don't get to be at all had missions and without seeing through cheap tricks like, hey, where did it go? <laughs> I like how he got tricked twice. Ah, <laughs> oh, that's great. You put the most of the off the flavor up with half the fat. Thanks, Willie. Water Dumble. Ek duck the frick the frick are these words, Almar. It's Diosa Felonis. Grab that family. Originally the first one pool, the marshal is this according to creature ripple fees on interest the oil and surface to the water. The church are nearly identical to the church with a close relative and first across the mobile world. It's very often closer to the evolution of the origins. And the vessel is only recently emerged to the aquatic habitat. I'm gonna have the bull board forms into this. 
Not, well, not Bull Boy, Grub Dog. Well, what is, I guess the start is the Bull Boy Larva, right? So I wonder how that is able to like transform to this. Is it just through environment? Or is it just through like genetics? Hmm. Iraq knows. I hate these guys. These these guys are so annoying. Like I, I, these guys are so annoying. They're easy to get with wing Pikmin and yellow Pikmin and rocks. But sometimes they'll just miss. And it's the worst thing ever. God, I hate these things so much. This creature's most dangerous weapon is its jaws. Also, wait, huh? I also learned. Well, I guess it's pretty obvious. But the whole entire ball core of this um spider is the mouth. Look, you can see it right there. It's not just a normal spider, because of course it isn't. But it just looks like that because it's like so far away and hard to tell. But I know, like if in case like at first I at first I really thought it was just a spider with a big old body. But no. This creature's most dangerous weapon is his jaws. It's his web. <laughs> Thank you, Alf. Anything that touches the web, such as thrown Pikmin, gets stuck and must be quickly rescued before it's eaten. I see this web trap wing Pikmin and what and what withstands bulls from rock Pikmin. So those spiders must be tougher than they look. It could build us to out of them. I could get I could be I could be that tough too. We click and you can whistle to get the Pikmin us from its webs. If you're feeling daring, you can touch the web and learn it wrecking your way. But if you're on the wrong side, you'll see your Pikmin get eaten in front of you. This is a tricky one. We can't charge until it moves, but it doesn't move unless something says it's spray as web. Since we must have risked the lives of my squad, there's no other choice. I must watch your bait. Good luck, troops. My life will be in your hands. Welcome to the world, crack open. It's over the moon, so deep, 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 and so you sell fruits with a nice, sweet, sweet, looks sweet and salty. Acnoid, Quavo, Vicuspera, a warp knit family. I think this is new. That's a new name. This boy like creature has a distinctive new expression of crap and a crab face. It's been as well as a hardy traffic area and waits for the freaking boiler to them. I want to go to the end of the rock world and the crab believer families. It's ambisexual and has eight legs. Some areas of the ground is meant to aid in reproduction. Though, of course, it cannot be returned to the zone. But the next year you heard that. That this species, the species got two organisms to also gender and stuck together. But since now has even found a four like a single sex system, this remains se se speculative. Yeah, I don't think it's two different ones. I mostly just think it's one. But interesting that it, it is, of course, dear I said it's a Ragnar because. I mean, first off, name. And where, ha where else have we seen a spider in a Pikmin game? But, interesting that this is basically a small, tiny little, basic spider. Nectarius Dandyfly. There's no need to attack this, these gentle flying creatures, but the nectar they drop makes a attempt to do it anyway. Wait until they get rhyme it and a circular flying pattern, then toss a Pikmin at it. If you hit one nectar noodles, it drops a little bit. It will drop a little bit. But hitting it in the hell will make it drop to all. I feel bad about seeing the nectar it stores up, but we need to survive too. I'm also that we follow long enough, it leads to the source of all that nectar hanging out of his belly. Big fruits, here we come. Hang on. Did we just walk through here? Does this thing only fly in circles? Look at him. Flying around like he's on the sky. All that nectar hanging just out of reach. Well, I'll get the last left. I'll be, I, I may be out of range with a steely fist, but I got some winged Pikmin who would like to crack at it. Or some yellows. Try to meet Rolf the boy and eat Rolf. The bird is the meat of what really highlights the sweetness of nectar. Nectarious Dandyfly, Aspertrid, and Ambrosius Dandyfly family. This course circle calls the two stages. First, it hatches underwater, where it has really is guarded with fruits and tadpoles and other small aquatic creatures. Once it grows large enough, it takes to the surface and completely changes its body to focus on pork nectar. The more nectar feeds on, the more second form on the simple abdomen. Important is your five segments. It's material is not ready for procreation. 
The scroll was approached with scrolls of, of war to prevent reflux from nectar stores. Interesting. Also, this enemy reminds me of something in the Hey Pikmin. It, it's a version of a snitch bug, but I don't know, I don't remember what it's called. But I do remember what it was like. It appears like it's like only one stage. But it, it was super cool. Like, it is such a big huge thing. That's what this thing, this enemy reminds me of. Not enemy. Friend. It's a friend. Orange board. I appreciate the warning coordination to let us know it's more dangerous than the other malls. And in that risk is best approach with a bomb rock while it sleeps. Funny, while replaying Pikmin 3, I actually try to use this tactic. Well, there's three of them around, since we since I know that um for some reason when bull boards just get a bomb rock tossed at them, they take a moment to look at it. Drawing drawing a bomb rock straight in the middle of the three exactly in this area, kills them all instantly and it's so perfect. So it's wait, that's the Easiest way to get that orange, not orange, such a swamp. Um, between those, it's large in color and it's so exaggerated that a few voices can wake it up instantly. Kind of like me. It's also a terror one in legs, which again, same. Those bulging eyes are a whole lot for battle. With no blind spots, we often find them asleep, but they wake as soon as we get close. For all we know, we're not only pretending we sleep, it's a, to wall us false sense of security. So stuff is that one second we're there, we're getting it up. It's all we need to go. All we need is to go in the heart. This boy's mini flex makes the stuff of the cherry stakes that shouldn't be missed. So question. I really thought are, just because they're different, do they have different skin? I mean, I don't mean skin color, I mean like different skin. According to Louie, this is way different from the um, normal bulbarb notes. So, is, is it just different because this one's specifically orange? Or is this like, for every single one, where it's different skins? Because then again, that leaves more questions how like, a bulbarb, like, matures. Oops, wrong button. Orange bubble, Oculus, Kegami, Kegami, or Origin, you know, Gump, that's the only one. This bulbarb speech is supposed to garner this color palette. Where a deep orange body and box blocks. The orange bulbers yellow boy shot eyes make it clear that this bulb is aggressively angry and the heart is strong. Make it easier to look at deep use of the unsuspicious and the rubbed up from the Burn Snagret. So weird that this is the only one in this whole entire game. Its bulk and speed makes it very fierce and mild. It's very difficult to achieve any paper and wants to snap one up in its beak. However, if you can dodge his beak when it comes down, it erects his trapness works against it, and if it gets stuck in the soil, then it leaves the head white open if you pelt it with pick it as fast as you can. I've never seen the button have one of these. I have all sorts of ideas about what under there. It could be a long snail tail, or a big, plump body stuck in the ground, or maybe below the neck, it just looks like us. That would be even worse, Brittany. If a snagger for real got out of the ground, and all we just saw was two tiny stubby human legs, I believe that would be worse than the pill is Snaggart. Now, I get this is big, and that big thing was scary, but that twisty neck can't twist all around, so all I have to do is just get behind it. Once you're there, pour away Pikmin, and you're golden. Smoke the syphilis whistle, then the devil just threw it into a metal rod, or hunk the onions, and murder to over the open flame. Burma Snaggart, Cereal Pest, Aquini, St. Snavian family. The board of this snagger is light in the way of an ambush and prey. But the- That's Lily. That's- that's literally Lily. The board of this snagger species lie away and wait and- Freaking God. <laughs> oh my- like, I can't get this voice, dude. Oh my, your voice is hard. Do you know that? It's so deep. I know Lily is deeper, but for some reason I can't pitch that perfectly. The board of this snagger species lie in the way of an ambush and capture prey. The boy type pitched perfectly adapted to such sun strokes. It violently attacks most of his dwelling insects. The story across the re re <laughs> react to the wide droves. Some species of snaggers suited to the very soil conditions have emerged, making the snagger and lost vehicle resident of species besides the bull board. This will resemble the burning snagger is the burning snare. Where is it? God! This makes me triggered! But you mentioned it ever since Pikmin 1. Where is it? The range of which is probably otherwise the snagger's range. 
while two men in prison were, when pulled on the ground, they could be distinguished by the presence or absence of tail and winged markings. I, I want to see the bird snare so bad. I want to see it so bad, dude. I want to see it so bad. Like, I really want to know what it would be like. Like, it is, I want, I want to fight a flying snagger. <laughs> what if the bird snare just turns out to be a bird that can just go into the ground and just come like up? Like, not a snagger. No, 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 no. A bird. <laughs> and that's it. <laughs> a bird with one foot. It comes out of the ground. And flies. <laughs> and that's just the whole entire thing. Alright. Iridescent Flint Beetle. I love this guy so much. Like, I freaking love this design. Like, this may be my favorite design. Like, look at it! It's a whole entire good old circle dude. Like, look at him. He has tiny little legs. It reminds me a bit of a prior dispensing machine. Only instead of pouring your coins, you throw pigment, and instead of toys, you get pellets and nectar. The popcorns are in those creatures. You might think it's ready for it, but when the time comes, you're probably not. No penalty for failure, except missing out on neat rewards, which is basically torture. Five one of these critters means you're a lucky, it's your lucky day. We can eventually hit, the pig, hit it with pigment, it will drop pellets and nectar. All you do is wait for it to stop and then press the attack. If you just follow a cool and good and a double and double and also the wish of suits, bolts, and marinades. As your Flint Beetle, Philly and Venelopus, Stracticus, Flint Beetle family. Flint Beetles are non core children that hold in rods and deep into the stair octal of night. These creatures take. I'm just making sure I read this correctly because. Well, I, I guess we never know what happens at night, so. Fair. These creatures do unnecessary food pellets in the storm to the same thing as the winter. But during the road session, we're still switching out. Recent research revealed that these pools are involved in membrane and seals preserves them in a star wars air toy environment. If you get to a room temperature, it seems that this pellet memory will keep its contents fresh up for six months. The memory is maybe the same for Maybe made from the same substances that give obstacle to the fit be this beautiful scene. This best man is associated with the previous document species, recognizable by variant patterns, but scorn it. I, I just like how that, that's just it. Just scorn it. These buzzing swarms are rare, but dangerous. No pigments are built to handle these insects. They'll just get carried off. Use green pigment instead. If all could also was a just right tuner pitch. I'm not gonna get to all the carry me around this planet. I don't need one, but I'm sure it'll take a lot more to get out of the captain airborne. These swords or tiny terrors were organized then again. So are we. I'll put my leadership skills to the test against the Nautilus any day. Pikmin, fall out. Room to go a little further into golden brown. And all the people saw us all the avatars are across the civil iron elemental centerpiece. Scornet, Spalgidus, Advinus, Hunt, Hunted Peck family. These are social insects, they're trouble groups. These three pets are being grown in the colony. This type of small, though still adult, orchard female. The guard than white eggs. The spider water is curving on the green world. I suppose they're queen sonic commands. They, they move in, in unions if they're a single entity. We see the dance through this eye is a sign of your home. But don't look too long. These, their stingers are still deadly. I, I never had to score it. Maestro. It, it takes real charisma to command such a large team. It's not like our captain that way. For SSC. Well, there's. Hmm. Maybe not. I don't listen to that priest that want to eat some fruit. I was only taking care of my spreading little bees. I envy that. I suppose I have all got a cap, alpha, and a cap, and captain. I could only do a half of what I want. The Maestro leads a whole swarm of squirrels flying in perfect military formation. My wish over the Pikmin might not be that tight, but do okay. But with you okay. I don't know why I just skipped one word. I put my wisdom against the Gallows Harp any, any day of the week. Squish them, throw it to Golden Brown, and it's real real cool. Spread the crowd to top of a crazy climbing child to give it a little kick. Square Maestro, Sporgitits, Avenus, 
Hard to pick family. Okay, still the same. New for his truck if you wait for a month. It doesn't show a particular nest. Marcus are cut to waters and it's searched for food of food. In his truck, the masters are weakest for a hibernation. Before the adventure of summer, she travels with a male partner to the core climate in the mainland where food is plentiful. The male is smaller than my show, with a white body and blue feet, back and tendrils. There's no way and dust cannot fly. Most of the secrets of the framework to the work control workers to carry out is command, which is issued via complex mu musical cues. And the marshal is not more than a his darkness. Workers perish along the way, the rest of the colony. Dang. Jeez, okay. But hey! Males do exist of this creature. Cool. I'm gonna go ahead and take a sip of my drink, because of course my voice is dying. These are my Louis voices. They're they're gonna be the death of me. Alright, why well, just might? The red helmet like shells covering his head as an efficient effective defense. I'll give it that. Like the green mall, it burst our ground comes up to attack. But this one has enough lift capacity to fly when threatened. I'll try to dive bomb you for the air and impale you on a stinger. But if we can dodge that and get stuck, it opens itself up to attacks. I just want to take a squad, charge for the back wings, poking uselessly at rock pigmen. But I get distracted every time at how cute rock pigmen look and really raw with a stubby little body. <laughs> Thanks, Brittany. I'm not as impressed with the red bug as I am with the real one. Yes, it's got plenty of tank and the heartbeat of a fisherman, but as I have beats the heart of a coward, what kind of soldier flies away instead of facing his enemy at so on solid ground? You think people are made of dinner stuff? Move to shore, we're still for the wolf when grind meat, rest place into old oil until it means it means white. After there's a corner when it's turned your earthiness to the spicy solid to think. Why just my Trivulence Reversa Vatani brown that family. It's close road to the original burning species, but this brown just my still still has to use some wings. Holy is it still makes the help it. Hope to have blow ground and pour the same type of lion and white in the before I this rock. The whole moon, but it gets hot. It tries to be as hard as steel due to Lexi's saturations of the floors, which Azor and Red Ride the and Shocks it sustains. Spuddlefish! Its tentacles are designed both for locomotion and a spray of screaming jet ink to cover its escape. You can tear the pen and soak the ink. So bail, a, bail them out quickly. But you also have to chase after it quickly with any, with any blueprint you have in your hand. Or regenerate the damage you dealt. Though it's also a shame to defeat since it's such a... Since it's so beautiful in motion. I actually never noticed that it actually just spews and darts away. So we're going to look at it again with the um, mini clip I have here. I've never looked at it like that before. I usually just... Kill it too fast. It's like a flower that blooms in the water instead of earth. So elegant, so beautiful, so hungry for Pikmin. I guess every rose has its thorns. Maybe it's something to do with the low friction down there, but all these other right creatures have are so slippery. Black ink is spells whenever it feels threatened. Probably contributes to that, come to think of it. Drawing ink and use over a stove to a thicker romantic. I need some red ink and so tender. So I'm going to go back for seconds. Small fish. Um, Omar. Okay, Omar. Omar, listen to me. Listen, 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 listen. Omar, stop going through your big book of dictionary and just putting out these random words out of nowhere and just out of your butthole. Like, who, 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 where did you think of this? Who thought of this? Said, don't kill both the uh, fluorescence. Screw your family. A tree that is transmissive wolf without any of the features of two typical to still attend a second trial of characteristics on Screw your family. It's rather with fans that double the powers of the flower and let it stir the bee as it swims, making a proper or ornamental pet. Because the hue of white absorption and cuts via fluorescence through its symbolism with a hue zone of data. 
So if you KJ, be sure to finish the job. Interesting to know about Omar's, like, dots of actual combat. It's just, that's basically a Charlie thing, but seeing Omar have no spots at two is great. It's nice to know that he's still like, if you're like, hey, kill this thing. You swim in schools. The only do they aren't picking in their own habitat, but they can jump out of water and go for prey in the air too. I expected to see the operator in such different environments, but not have def I'm definitely taking notes. I saw the swimming and captain and thought they were playing around. The only one came right at me and ow. This guy's a play. You bet I have has to call Pippin back. If one of these things catches them. Be advised you're not safe just because you're out of water. As I know as I know as I know now for experience. They can kind of jump out catching prey that strays too close to the surface. I guess let's be just sharp. Sports ball surface is so mean. To move on the face. Porking bueno? Frank Omar. No one does piss catium. Ellipse family. One of the students do on development due to the worst hours of the rock of films. But this is simply as normal for drum form. Though it does all of virtual fans that offer the wrong code of film to hope. Then the hope to compensate for this. You can leap hard enough on the water to catch a full form print. The skills comprised of the round parts of the long sides are well known to return a lot of during breeding se season. I don't need to know about the Omar. I don't need to know about these creatures smashing each other, alright? I get that's just a way of life, but I don't need to imagine that in my mind, in my brain. When other creatures draw near, and this bubbles from nozzles on this out covering, out covering. The bullets don't last long, but you can hit the hit it among the Pikmin across the early. Though the bullets trap creatures it doesn't seem an interest in eating it catches. Maybe this is just an idea of play? If so, it could be dangerous to game as its playmates. Why does everyone just assume that everyone just has Pikmin when they hire these creatures? I, I get this is Pikmin at 4 or 4, and like, if they're gonna have Pikmin, but like... Why does- why do they just all assume like, oh yeah, they're gonna have Pikmin, duh. I admit it, I'm guilty of getting caught in their bowls delivery. I love falling in the air, getting a bird's eye view of the plant. Hang on. Ugh, Alpha wanted me to tell the copy. Copy already does that for us. He has no sense of romance. Those reasons that doing that, the worst this thing can do to you is jail you inside one of those bubbles and speed from the holes all over, which is pretty bad. Since I got a regular cell, I need help from outside to escape. Perfect vinegar, new hugs. More until the boy meat and blood makes the vinegar and show for a few hours. The work you want to sit through the rest of the flavor. Wild well, puss. I'll. I'll. <laughs> i piss. Did, did I? I Kabula. Flower family. Whose orders to retreat make it look like an octopus is the name. Well, it's close enough to a starfish. It's no longer a sense sleeps by day. But it's just where it's supposed to be harder, it's where it dries, when it dries off from the food itself, oh, it's using bubbles. What's the reason to suggest that the true purpose of these bubbles is to protect these eggs during spawning season? But, you're not around the eggs, buddy. Okay, then. Bug-Eyed Cromad! It's similar to the designs of our planet future exoskeletons, but much, much bigger. Its eyeballs are equally enlarged, making them perfect targets. Their homes are an angle on a single hole, but rather a network integration in our tunnels. We can use to retreat the wall ground. I'd be worried to re emerge somewhere else entirely. I don't know how this big thing can fit into that tiny hole it just has. All I can think about is how about since we defeated one of it, these, is how nice we'll be able to sleep on a soft belly. I could even use it to show that I can cut up your bed. This for me though. This eye is not big enough for all of us. I tried to take it on one-on-one -on -one combat to spare his last round of Pikmin Squad, but his shell was still hard even for my steely fists. If only I was tall enough to reach his eyes, then we see who was really tough. Man! If only you could use something about that, Charlie! Oh my god, seriously, I'm still feeling an old, poor boy. You don't have any leftover, I just threw away for a piece of deep flavor. Bug-Eye Cromat, Cambora Subterranean, Cromat Family. 
work is close closer to the Hermit Crawl Man. It makes a home in the burrow rather than a shell. It has an odor of overdone eyes with which to secret a party quite a while that are visible mind. These enormous eyes can receive circle of paradise light as all as well as the ultraviolet infrared spectrum. Uh, it is well protected from predators. I used to live over the past years and go to the mis and miss stars by repeating at actresses. Okay. Gloria Toaster. Problem. Seeing him in Pigman causes a dispute and confusing his attackers and amidst the chaos. It says how it sets a tricky chunk to pick up prey. Solution. Nor ink. It's non-toxic and can't hurt you. Stay calm, exploit it, so be it behind it, and force your strikes out of a powerful tail bulb. I know. It's also reflected in our other tiny. How can I see anything? I'm positive their tails are kind of fruit. I tried once to take the away from the pigment and I have announced it. It still could break its seeds. But I'll try to talk me out of it. Since now everything that uh, looks like fruit tastes like... Tastes good. And he might have a point. Whoa! <laughs> Someone else has a different um, phrase, uh, meaning for that. It might look like much of the face of it, but that's because his deadly weapons are hidden. I see him do tongue through things that I can never unsee. And he spray everywhere to bite at me. It was particularly uh, mercy. Points through with herbs and oil to the white crystal and to also roast on each other. Hopefully the church is for a white and very cream sauce. Well, it toaster, Moloch's guest, many guests, Moloch's game family. These creatures and creatures have yet to fully involved in the show of Moloch's to the more advanced boister. Compared, compared to the boister, this creature is socially small. The fact that his minerals do not pro protrude or significantly as as range of boisters is due to the part that focuses more through molecules. Its vital organs are located deep within the creature's curl case. While a white appendage is on its back, it's actually a gill. It refers to a wire rehabilitation source which can capture an eye. Not suspect a small pair with sticky tendrils. So you may tell me, but I just. Wait, no, that, that doesn't work. But, think about it. You mean to tell me that if I just take that thing it has. Put it out of the water, then it's gonna instantly try to die. Well, it's gonna die because it can't breathe. Not try to die, that makes any sense. But it'll just die because it can't breathe. Is that what you're telling me, Omar? Pecus Aristo Crab. I, it had the right idea of cutting its enormous claw and crystal shell. But we have rock paper for that. Why did you get Pecus Claw? It's not so bad. You have to be careful not to drown, though. Since you don't usually be one near on the water. It's got extendable. Ex accessible legs to thwart our pigment charge, so I find that throwing pigment is more effective. That also works for freeing anyone trapped in, in one of its bubbles. There's something so familiar about this thing. Oh! It was for the whole container onion I studied in my research that in recent days. Now, that was a dangerous plan. One little inclusion and I could have stopped crying for hours. That's what that's what onions do, Brittany. Arrows are rocking supposed to feed scissors, but how come my steely fist don't do anything against this thing's claws? Sure, I brought a few bubbles and it hit it, but all that culture was attracting me inside. Goo 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 goo. Goo the show cocoons in the hot rock. When you turn, I try to put it on a slider in the middle of his room. Pocus Arista Crab, Brat Reek Rat Rissus, Ear Cereal. On your shelf, family. Well, there you go, Brittany. It's a little white claw. It's good for you to catch a prey for self defense. It wasn't surprisingly for his inane call. His meaning call. Most of the crabs away from each other around it. When you explain why the crab is fearful and don't play with the claw, is damaged. It will also come for the claws and not for regeneration capabilities, which are restored to the complete the single one up. Also known to pull bubbles and unattack, but as a result of it, eventually for the wrong discharge value when I already stress. Huh, okay. Well, that's gonna be it for today, guys. I know we actually just stopped behind the Quagga Barnacles, but we're gonna do that next time. We actually, we're almost done. Next time might be the end of this. This is way shorter than Pikmin 2 ones on Piklopedia. 
But we might get done next part. Who knows? And that's going to be completely it for Pikmin 3. Alright, I'll see you guys next time. Bye, everybody.